After watching Yamada and Ishimaru trudge out, the rest of us return to our rooms. Please tell me I have free time. Man, it's still morning. I feel like we spent all day in there. Anyway, to pick myself back up, what should I do today? Let's talk to Ugami again. I think that's how you pronounce your name. Uh, map. Map, map, map. I like how when I'm playing, the frame rate is 30 frames a second, and then when I go into the menus, it jumps to uh, 60 frames. That's pretty cool. Although, there's not really any point in having like higher frame rate at the start menu anyway. We. I don't know why I did that. Oh, she might be here. Let's check the map. Again. Nope, no one's here. We. It seems that she, they're not here again. Up to the next floor. Oh, they're in the same place as last time. Let's talk to her again. Um, let's still keep going. I was thinking of cutting out the parts where I'm walking and just like going straight to the conversations. But again, it's not exactly flow and the... Uh, I kind of like the flow. Okay, where is she? Is she in the same place? No, she's not. Uh, let's check the map again. Oops. She, they, she says she's near the physical lab, so where are they? Hello? This is the entrance to the physical lab. And this is the entrance to the upper floor, which I can't open yet. Where are they? I'm getting annoyed. Hello? Did I miss something? Oh, there she is. Oh my god. <laughs> the air weighs heavily. How about it? Should I invite Ugami to do something? Yes. Are you saying you wish to practice with me? Very well. Follow me and prepare yourself. Ugami trained me long and hard. I feel like I've gotten a little stronger. Cool. Ugami and I bonded a little. Would you like to give Ugami a present? I'm not sure if I have anything to give her, but I'll check. Mm. <laughs> Magnificurry. That's funny. Uh, G Slate. Uh, water rubber. Uh, no, 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 no. Manamasa. Mashira's tear. Suitcase, vibrating cord, Tikishi, Oblot, Voljubu doll, small light, voice changing bow tie. I'll be right back, I'm just gonna check what presents make her happy. Well, it seems I don't have anything to give her, so I'm just gonna not give a present. Damn it! Do I still have free time? Ooh, I still have time. Okay, I am going to go buy some presents. I'll be off screen for a bit. I shall see you guys with Ogami again once I get all those presents. Back in a flash. Literally. Alright, I'm back with Ogami. I, I honestly did not get any presents to give to her, so uh, I'm just going to hope that she's going to tell me something. It's been so long since I felt the wind. How about it? Should I invite Ogami to do something? Hang out. I greatly admire your voracious desire for strength, so allow me to share with you one of my secret techniques. Ooh, I learned Ogami's secret technique. I felt like I've gotten a lot stronger. Please, please, please. Yes! Ogami and I bonded a little. I don't have anything. Sorry. Damn it! So I guess you really do have to give presents in order to get something. Bullshit. <laughs> I should have just talked with someone else. Oh well. Ahem, may I have your attention please? The time is now 10pm. Nighttime is now in effect. 
The cafeteria is now off limits and the door will be locked momentarily. And with that, I wish you all a good night. Sweet dreams. It's nighttime again. I guess I gotta call it a day. Happy New Day. I am an advocate of celebrating not just the start of every new year, but every new day. Therefore, every day is a celebration. Have another happy new day. What is he planning? Oh, that was weird. Good morning, you guys. It's now 7 a.m. Rise and shy. Let's make today the best day it can be. Morning, that means the cafeteria. To the cafeteria! Away! Neither Ishimaru nor Kitty Kitty are here today. Kitty's on lookout, dude. As for Ishimaru, I know not. Hmm. Let that let that ingrate be. He. Hmm. Well, you're unusually angry. What can you do, dude? They're in love and at war. Don't put me in the same category as that virgin. I wouldn't want to catch his virginity. What? <laughs> what? It wouldn't matter to you if you caught it. You're definitely one yourself, dude. Wait. That's contagious. <laughs> oh God. Let's put this lowbrow discussion aside and partake in some breakfast, shall we? However, in the moment I reached out to grab the food in front of me. Laughter. Oh no. I can already tell who that is. A second later, the cafeteria door burst open and they came into view. Yep, Genocider. As I expected, Genocider show, as well as... You didn't ask why we're together. It's not even worth answering. I'll give you a hint. I'm wearing red lingerie today. Ooh. Cool? But we didn't ask. Hey, you. Well, what? Your combat stats. From bottom to top. 88, 57, 84. You totally does this make me look fat type. And get a load of them frickin' bazongas. What, do you soak them in milk or something? Eek! Touch Asahina. And I will destroy you. So, what is it you came for? I find it hard to believe you simply came to join us for breakfast. Oops. Obviously, I came to talk. Talk? There's something you're not telling me. He means alter ego. Forgive us, but we can't discuss this now. And why not? We have our reasons. You've been playing us for fools this whole time, and now you're asking us for info, dude? Then it's settled. If we get out of here, I'm feeding your carcasses to the vultures. You are one cruel dictator, dude. And this is quite the democracy. You won't even give info to someone without a, with a dissenting opinion. That's not actually... Fine then, then, at least tell me about Ishimaru. I happened to run into him yesterday and he seemed off, so I was curious. Ishimaru is no longer with us. Hold on, Celeste, don't say it like that. Did he have a nervous breakdown? Is he no longer able to cope with the situation? Men who wave around a cheap sense of justice are, by and large, weaklings. But thanks to him, things could get very interesting. What do you mean, interesting? I urge you, heed this warning, and don't bet on this farcical companionship, or it'll come back and bite you. So he came all this way, just to talk down to us. It appears I'm not liked. Very well, I'll fulfill your wishes and take my leave. Yes, let's. You stay. <laughs> White knight, baby. Why you gotta be like that? I need me some more lovin'. I swear, if she tucked her tongue into her mouth where it should be, I would consider her attractive. Anyone else? Anyone else think that? I won't even justify that with a response. As he said that, Togami slowly turned away, and then suddenly bolted through the door. You're running? I get it, I get it. You're a hit and run kinda guy. Wait, 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 wait! So, in the end, what exactly happened? I wonder, could Togs be... 
the typical starts a jerkwad <laughs> but develops into a softy when the story changes direction archetype. No spoilers. Thought so. <laughs> Free time? The rest of us still remaining in the cafeteria finish breakfast and disperse to our rooms. Free time? Let's see, what should I do today? Okay, free time. Uh, I'm actually going to end the recording here. Um, I've played enough today. I will play more tomorrow since I'm on spring break. This will be a spring break recording palooza. I will not upload anything till the end of my spring break. But I will be recording at least an hour a day. So I shall see you in the next one. Later.